You love their hardwood, but how about their hot dogs? Home Depots in Chicago all sell hot dogs inside the store from a place called Fixin' Franks. They've got hot dogs and Polish sausages galore. But I came here for the newly added Wagyu steak dogs and bratwurst. Unfortunately, this location was all sold out. So I decided to eat their Chicago dog, the Maxwell Street Polish, and their regular Polish before moving on to the next location. They all have the same toppings. Relish, tomato, diced onions, a pickle spear, celery salt, yellow mustard, and sports peppers. There's nowhere to eat these hot dogs inside or outside, so we're going to be eating them in the car. First up is the Chicago dog. Um, it's, it's closer in line to something that you would make at home. Oh, I got mustard on my seat. I'll give the hot dog an 8 out of 5. Now the Polish. And that's, it, 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 it pretty much tastes like the hot dog as well. It's, it's, a, it's a little bit spicier. It, do, it doesn't taste like gourmet or, or restaurant quality hot dogs. They taste like pretty solid homemade hot dogs. You know, they're, they're pretty much indistinguishable. This is the Polish, this is the hot dog. I'm gonna have to give that Polish a 7 out of five. Now we got the Maxwell Street Polish, which is what I'm excited about. Oh, uh, that, that's pretty good. The onions help it out uh, a little bit. It basically tastes like a, like a thicker hot dog. It, it, it's, it's my favorite out of the bunch, but not by much. I'm, I'm gonna give it an eight and a half out of five. What a bummer. Moving on. Just a little further up the road is another Home Depot with another Fixin' Franks. This location had the Wagyu Steak Dog, but they were sold out of the bratwurst. So I ordered the steak dog, and we will be moving on to yet another Home Depot location shortly. Fun fact, the steak dog and bratwurst take 10 minutes to cook, and when you order it, the people working there look very angry. And total shocker, the steak dog comes with everything that you saw before. From so fall, there it is split open. It tastes like a burnt hot dog. I, I don't I don't even think I can finish that. I'll give the Wagyu steak hot dog like 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 a like a six and a half out of five. Things aren't looking good. I'm heading to one more Home Depot, and if they don't have this Wagyu bratwurst, I'm calling it quits. Luckily for me, this third Home Depot had the bratwurst. They gave me the same warning about a 10 minute wait time and shot me a dirty look. But after 10 minutes, I had my Wagyu hot dog and feeling very full and full of poop. But let's give the old gal a shot, shall we? It doesn't taste like a brat at all. It, it just tastes like, um, it tastes like a hot dog. <laughs> they all taste like hot dogs. It's, it's, it, it, it's, listen, I'm sure if you're a hungry contractor that's been working in the sun all day, that'll hit this spot. But for everyone else, they're, they're just average hot dogs. I'll give the Wagyu, uh, bratwurst, uh, 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 a seven and a half out of five. And I leave, uh, pretty disappointed. Well, that's it. For a lot of hype on the internet and YouTube comments, Home Depot hot dogs just don't deliver on taste like the ones sold in restaurants. See you next time on The Quest, The Sausage Quest. <laughs>